to, to um, Terry and Brad and uh, Rico and anyone from the Two-Tone family who uh, we lost along the way. It all began that summer. In fact, it pretty much happened overnight. One minute we were card-carrying punks, worshipping at the Church of Joe Strummer, the next we were rude boys in black and white. Hopeless school leavers, lackluster wasters, disillusioned and tutored, pretty vacant, no future. Then a whisper came here and there, there were new kings in town, with a blue beat to share. From Kingston, Jamaica, to Coventry, a special delivery, a.k.a. Crisp white shirts and short cropped hair, a cathedral ruin still one spare, tower block flats and council houses, smart dress, boys in stay press trousers, reggae rhythm with the guts of punk dancing all night, getting drunk, records and badges for fa factory money, skins and mods thinking us funny. And the driving force behind this whole scene were some boys from Cov who made it seem that this was our thing. This was our time. These were the best days to be alive. The enemy said, this was the home of the rock steady sound and the boys of two tone. A windrush calypso from a concrete jungle, an innocent kiss less than innocent fumbles, from pubescent to adolescent. Stars aligned in the ascendant, clashed down and Roots record collector gave way to madness, specials and the selector. Sharp suits and leather loafers, top of the box eating tea on the sofa. That night a real scar take over, the transformation was complete. The night of the gig. Feeling great. Me and my mates looking ace, getting the bus, feeling the tension. This political stuff someone failed to mention. I mean, we weren't naive or anything like that. We'd seen plenty of scraps following the clash. But this was heavy. Too many skins, too much aggro, flailing limbs, National Front going recruiting, British movement putting the boot in. Ain't no black in the Union Jack, lads at gigs under attack. We couldn't understand the logic why you'd want to White Island and dance to reggae music. But all that lot, and Thatcher, and the bouncers, and the NF, and all they bring disappeared when we heard our rude boys sing. This was our life. This was our way. We've got a voice and something to say. Didn't listen to lords and political vultures. We've got our own black and white culture. This was magic. The skanking beat. Blue tonic suited and Jerry Dammer's teeth. So went our scene in days of frivolity. My life, my world. Coventry, the specials, and me.